Hello! In this video, we are going to prove the following theorem. Suppose a, b, and c are real numbers. If a plus c is equal to b plus c, then a is equal to b. So we're trying to prove the statement about every three real numbers. So give me any three real numbers. I'll call them a, b, and c. And our goal is to prove if this is true, then this is true. So let's assume that this is true. Our goal now is to deduce that a is equal to b. Now we're going to use some of the field properties of the real numbers in order to do this. Now, first of all, we know that for every real number a, a plus zero is equal to a. Right, so we're going to use this. And the other fact that we're going to use is that every real number has a negative. That is to say, for every real number x, there exists a real number y such that x plus y is equal to zero. Now, since this second statement works for every real number, it must work for the number c. So really, there exists a real number y such that c plus y is equal to zero. Okay, now we're going to show that a is equal to b through a chain of equalities. First of all, we know that a is equal to a plus zero, right? That's what our first fact tells us. Second of all, we know that zero is equal to c plus y. So we can replace the zero here with c plus y. And now if you recall, another one of our field properties was the associated property of addition, right? We can move the parentheses around the a plus c. But by our hypothesis, we know that a plus c is equal to b plus c, so we can replace a plus c with b plus c. And now let's use the associative property again to move the parentheses around the c plus y. But again, c plus y is equal to zero, and b plus zero is equal to b. So through this chain of equalities, we see that a is equal to b. And that's exactly what we wanted to prove, so this completes the proof. And so yeah, this property is often referred to as the uh, cancellation law for addition, right? If a plus c is equal to b plus c, then a is equal to b, right? A similar argument can be used to show that if a plus b is equal to a plus c, then b is equal to c. Yeah, that's pretty much it for this video.